In today's video, I'll be showing you how can you fix your Google Chrome's web browser that says your Google Chrome is being managed by your organization. This video is sponsored by cdkeyoffers.com where you could buy legit software, games, and license keys. Just go ahead and search for the games or software you're looking for, hit the buy now button, and simply enter the coupon code DUDE20 to save up up to 20% from your purchase. After paying, you will now immediately receive the key on your account and be able to activate your software or license key. Alright, let's now go ahead and head off to our desktop. Alright, now that we are on our desktop, first we're going to be going to our start menu and then go ahead and open up Reg Edit. Go ahead and right click on this app and click on the Run as Administrator. So before we edit anything on this registry editor, we need to close first our web browser and then right click on your Google Chrome's web browser and then click on the close window. Once we are able to close our Google Chrome's web browser, we can then go ahead and navigate through the hkey underscore current user and then go to the software folder, look for Google and you'll be able to see here the Google registry folder. So we need to empty this folder so before we do that we need to first create a backup for this particular registry in any case that this might break our web browser. So go ahead and first click on the Chrome folder and go to file and hit the export button. We need to create a folder let's say a backup folder and then under that folder we're gonna be naming this as backup1 underscore 1 and then hit the save button. Once we are able to export that one, we can now go ahead and right click on this folder and click on the delete button. Hit the yes button on the prompt that will be shown on your screen and it might show you that particular error and we can just go ahead and leave that as is. Next we need to also scroll down until we see the policies folder right here. And again, expand this folder until we see the Google Chrome folder. So if you have any folder underneath this Google folder such as the Chrome folder, we need to again go to the file and export that one and we can go ahead and name this as backup underscore 2 hit the save button and then we can now go ahead and proceed and delete this folder after that we can now go ahead and scroll up up to the top and unmaximize the hk underscore current user folder expand the hk underscore local machine and then go to software next we're gonna be going to the google folder We'll be able to see here another Google folder and on the top again to confirm we are under the HK underscore local underscore machine. So go ahead and expand again the Google folder and you'll be able to see here once again the Chrome folder. And under the Chrome folder we'll be able to see here various uh, folders such as the extensions and native messaging hosts. We need to again export first the Chrome folder and we could name this one as backup underscore 3. Hit the save button and once done we can now go ahead and delete this folder. And again if you are able to see this kind of error just let it be. Hit the ok button and just ignore that kind of prompt. Again we can now go ahead and unmaximize this folder right here and then look for the policies folder similar to what we did just a while ago. And then go to google and again we need to export this one for backup purposes. Name this one as backup underscore dot 4. Hit the save button once again and then go ahead and delete this folder. Once done, we can now go ahead and relaunch our Google Chrome's web browser. And hopefully by this time around, you are no longer able to see the Google Chrome is being managed by your organization. So that's about it. Thanks for watching. Hopefully I was able to manage to help you out. Let me know if any of the solutions that I've shown you in this video help you. Again, it's your tech edit here. See you in my next tech videos.